Hello, Sagittarius. Happy, happy February 2015. Okay, so let's see what card is in store for you. And let me shuffle it again. Let's see. So I had to redo these videos. <laughs> so here we are. Must be um, from last month into this month, uh, Mercury in retrograde is definitely doing its thing. So, Sagittarius, let's see what card is for you. Ah, Two of Swords. And I think in my old video, this was what you guys got too, in the other videos. So that's really, so it's meant to be. I just go with the flow. So, Two of Swords. It's asking you to be confident in who you are, Sagittarius. Be confident in you, okay? is what this card is saying. You can see that she's blindfolded with two swords in uh, in her hand. She has two swords and she's confident. She doesn't have to see what she's doing. She knows her, her skills, her potential, what she's gifted with, what she's naturally good at. So uh, whatever you're good at, Sagittarius, you know it. And maybe you are putting your energy out there for whatever it is that you need to accomplish just be confident in that you've done everything that you can do okay and the swords represents um the air element in the tarot deck so maybe allowing yourself to kind of breathe a little bit more relax a little bit more in your own confidence not allow yourself to get stressed out by whatever it is that you are experiencing right now in your life it's just a strong message of being confident and then and if you like tarot there's another thing that you can do is really to get in control of the mind and relax the mind is meditation. So the full moon is happening in this month of February on the 3rd. And the full moon will be in Leo, so your other sister fire sign, <laughs> or brother fire sign, whatever you want to call it. But uh, it's, it's a fire sign of Leo, so uh, what positive aspects that you already have that you can heighten in this uh, full moon in Leo happening on the 3rd new moon in Aquarius happening on the 18th and uh, what aspects of this air sign uh, can you incorporate in your life so maybe thinking outside the box if you're searching for something new to do um, something creative to do maybe a new job being creative really um, exploring yourself what are you good at what what do you feel called to do and then stick with that it's a Chinese New Year it's a sheep year so if you happen to be born in a sheep year, no matter what element it is, it's your year, especially if it's wood, because it's a wood um, uh, sheep year. So see what that means for you. It's also an eight year. So this is a year of, how would they say, um, an, an infinity year. So what pattern do you want to start and continue for the rest of your year? This is what you need to ask yourself and then bring that forth because you know, being driven, being organized, being ambitious, whatever the, the in numerology, you can look at what eight means and see what you can um, incorporate with that. On my other channel, I'll be doing more meditation videos and so on. So when I have that link up, I'll share it on this channel in the March video so you guys can take a look at that kind of cross, uh, cross, uh, crossing channels here. <laughs> So thank you guys so much for supporting the channel. I hope all this information helps you. Let's see if I'm forgetting anything. Oh, yes. Yes, important thing. Sagittarius, hey. Saturn is in Sagittarius for the next, like, three years. So this started on December um, December 23rd of 2014, and it's going to continue into December 19th of 2017. So this is a great energy. I love Sagittarius. I love the energy. Um so this is like a year that is is definitely meant for you. So and and also Sagittarius will show you what doesn't work and what works. This is for all signs. So really follow what works because this eight years is going to set a pattern. And I wish I said uh, said that about um, Saturn and and that energy in my other videos. I wish I said that in the other videos. But again, I always tell you guys to watch your rising sign and your north node sign 
so you ended up watching three videos on my channel and it's a general reading so if you want it to apply to you then you have to get your own personal reading and you can do that by clicking on my website on the tarot and just clicking the, the reading that you desire. All right, and I'll get it in the email and we'll connect. Uh, I could read for you through Skype. Um, or, um, yes, yeah, Skype is, is pretty great to do that, or through Google uh, Chat. So, anyway, have a great, great year. And, um, oh, yeah, I can also email it to you a recording of the reading for you as well. So, you have three options Google, Skype, or email you a uh, MP3 of your personal reading. So, just book it on the website. I get a lot of messages on YouTube and on um, Facebook. So you can connect with me on Facebook and Twitter, but I get a lot of messages on Facebook. And um, if you watch the videos, then you'll know to go to the website and click on the reading that you desire. Thank you so much and have a wonderful, wonderful February.